I've been searching the books, trying to find the best midfielder to scout in our Inazuma 11-2 Let's Play. And bloody hell, lads, I think I got him. Let's do this. TXM style. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to episode number seven. I want to save Inazuma 11 2 Crossfire. This is a mod of Inazuma 11 2 made by famous YouTuber HMaz for me to play. Um, and if you guys like Inazuma 11, make sure you subscribe to the channel for daily Inazuma 11 videos. In the last episode, we made our way to Hokkaido, and today we're going to be heading to um, Alpine and doing the Alpine match and all that stuff. But I have a couple things to show you, and those are in the form of two new players on the club. We have Jonathan Seller, the forward from Brainwashing, with Economy, Inazuma 1, and Attack Scan. I want to choose this guy because Economy plus Inazuma 1 feels pretty interesting to me. I want to give him a go. Uh, we've also Toad. Now, Toad is particularly interesting to me because of a certain move called Warp Drive. The combination of Fake Ball and Warp Drive to me seem very powerful, and I'm very curious to give them a go. So, in today's matches... We're going to be make sure we're using both of them. I think we're going to do Alpine today. We may go and do Otaku, um, potentially, but I'm not 100% sure about that. Also, I guess we can get Aurelia on the squad. Hell yeah, I'll take Aurelia. Or just Charm. I'm assuming Aurelia will stick having all skills, but I'm very curious to see what skills Aurelia ends up having. We have Wood Chopper, and we have 300 prestige points. Okay, sick. Right. Um, let's just keep going, I guess. And we'll make our way. Ooh, we're about to take on all pine. I always get lost at this part in the game. I don't know why. There's just something about, um... Oh, bloody hell. Destroy the bear. Absolutely destroy the bear. Oh, my God. Yeah, we can see all pine. Keep going, lads. Keep going. Okay. But, um, I'm very excited for this all pine match. Because mostly I'm just excited to use our two new players. I think, um, we'll, we'll come with a formation in a sec. But we'll definitely have Seller and Toad up in there. Even if they are a bit lower leveled compared to everyone else. Um, hopefully they can still like put in the work. We can use our economy in Azuma 1 um, to, to good effect. I'm curious how much TP that means is going to use. I don't know too much about economy in Azuma 11 too. I don't know much. Fair, I don't know much generally, but I definitely don't know much about economy like um, and how it works, especially how skills work in Azuma 11 too. But okay, I guess we can give it a go actually. All right now, so it's 38 TP. So that's pretty good to be fair for such a strong move in Azuma 1. That's good. I'll happily take that. Plus, being able to use a tax scan as well. That might be quite massive, to be honest. Like, that might be really helpful. Okay. Sick. That's probably, that was a game possession of the ball. There was no reason for me to run away there. I guess I'm literally just a coward. Okay, do I remember how the bloody hell to, um, to do this and to get, like, to the next location? And this Well, not the next location, but, like, do the next thing in this game. I don't know. I might be asking a lot of me. Hi. Okay, yeah, yeah, I do. It's talk to you. Talk to Sean at the Old Pine Gates. Let's go, lads. Woo, let's go. What's up, Sean? Hey, Mark. Oh, it is. It is literally Sean. Whoa, what a shocking development. What a shocking plot twist. The guy who killed the bear is probably the bear. Well, I guess the bear tamer. I don't know. But he did something to the bear. But anyway, we're going to be taking on Old Pine now. Let's do it. Let's absolutely do it. And let's, um, I guess what we'll do first is, is change up the formation and make sure we have the players that we want to be using on the team. Okay, right. Let's take a look. So, um, we want to have, okay, right. Who do I want? Do I want Bobby to stay up front? I think so. Let's put on, actually, no, let's put on Jonathan Seller instead for now. Um, yeah, I like you being there. I like you being there. We'll swap you. For, we'll swap Toad. Toad needs to go in somewhere. I can't take off the Infantile. The man's a, the man's a legend. Even if he does kind of suck. Actually, we'll, we'll take off the Inf... No, I kind of like you. Can we do a different formation? Butterfly feels like the one that's calling to me because it means I can do something like this. Um, have, where, what, what the hell do I want? Infantile kind of there. Have you on there, have you there. Something along these lines. And then swap. I do kind of want Willy on the squad. We'll put Willy there. 
sure. Why not? Let's do it. Uh, I'm trialing out new stuff. I'm trialing out new stuff. Okay. Right, the match against Alpine is here. Let's do it. Go with the flow. And he's in defense. Whoa. Sean Frost is in defense. What a plot twist. Right, so we have Mark and Goal. Cyborg, Fantile, Tori, and Willie in defense. Toad is our defensive midfielder. Eric and Chaney is our midfielders. And up front, we have Seller, Blood, and Jude. Okay, let's do this. They have uh, ropes with Aurora Kern and Land of Ice and Power Element. Bloody hell. Uh, Spinning comes by Gleason. Sean Frost has Land of Ice and Aurora Dribble. Um, goes pull Land of Ice. Will and Twist Land of Ice. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Comet Shot. Nothing too fancy. This guy has Rainbow Arc, which is pretty cool. Rainbow Arc on you as well. So we have a lot of long shots to deal with. Okay. Doesn't like there's anything too bad for us to take. We should hopefully be all right here. Right. Jonathan Seller is the main person we're trying to trial out. Him and Toad. And we immediately mess up passing because... Who would TXMB if not an absolute loony? Okay, right. We're just going to kind of let them progress a little bit. They don't have a whole lot of offensive power. So we should be alright to be able to stop them. See? Ah, never mind. Okay, awesome. Lovely stuff. Let's go for a quick draw with Willy. Cheers, Willy. Appreciate you, my guy. Okay. Jude over to Jonathan Seller. Can we attack scan past you is our main thing. We cannot. Okay, I guess that's what you get when you're slightly under-leveled. Um, but we're going to go for a defense scan with Cyborg, who can take it. Then can we get a cheeky pass over to you? Over to Jonathan Sellers. Nope. Sean Frost is in the way. Okay. Chaney. Okay, 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 okay. We should be all right here. Um, we're going to go for a fake ball. Sick. Pass it over to Blood. Get a pass straight to Jude. Never mind, it's an offside pass because apparently I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Uh, if we have only have one way of beating Sean, I guess it's through Jude. We're going to Illusion Ball. And then we're going to try something out, which is called that. Plus a Shrine Drive. Alright. Let's do it. Let's knock him with the powerful Shine Drive. Let's try and get a goal. Don't think we will. Yeah. Okay. Not too unexpected. Still disappointing, nevertheless. Okay. Can we... Never mind. You get you on for your Aurora Dribble. Okay. We're definitely on a bit of a come down here. Um, I would love to try and get a goal before... Okay. Right. Jonathan Seller... Jonathan Seller, Jonathan Seller, Jonathan Seller, Jonathan Seller. In a Zuma 1. Pull it. No, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way. No way. Ah, irritating. Okay, we're going into the second half. Nil, nil. They're going to get that automatic goal with Eternal Blizzard. And suddenly it's going to be a lot harder to stop their defense. No, their offense. Their defense will be a bit easier, though. But we should be hopefully all right. Okay. Right. Um... We're gonna, what we're going to do here is this little idea I have called firing up and then spamming warp drive. We have two warp drives in us. I'm curious if we just kind of even ditch the defensive elements of Toad and kind of purely focus on just kind of warp driving through everyone. Never mind. Okay, right. That was a really interesting idea for about two seconds when he then lost the ball there. Okay, I'm not going to give up completely on him. Um, maybe not quite the dribble powerhouse I was hoping um, when I saw what all his moves were, but we should be okay. Okay, let's try and get... Okay, your TP is basically completely gone. We should be able to knock an Ember Penguin number two straight into your goal. Perfect. Perfect. We can definitely pull this back right now. We can definitely pull this back. I mean, maybe we still have the ultimate dribbler. I think we might. Um, we'll give them some, some more tests as we go. We might go and do the otaku match. I'm not too sure. Um, maybe. Okay, I'm going to give Jonathan Seller another go. Never mind. Okay, Jonathan Seller, this is your moment. We did it. We found an amazing player. A truly amazing player. A truly fantastic player. Okay, I like it. I like it. I like it. 
Okay, sick. Okay, we're just going to take... This now should just be a relatively straightforward path to the end. Toad! Lovely. Get that foul, mate. See, I'm so, I'm so into the idea of Toad. I think it's genuinely... Oh my god, can we stop just messing up completely? We're making rookie mistakes! Okay, we're going to go for a Marge in the hand. We kind of need to, or else it's tying. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Mark. Hell yeah. Okay, and we get full time. Okay, we got the win. We got the absolute win there. Perfect. Okay. We're doing all right. No one got any new moves there, which is disappointing. But oh well, what are you going to do? Um, he is pretty good at football, it has to be said. He is decently good at football. And we've got the Gemini Storm match coming up now. I guess we'll probably try and do that next episode. What we might go and do is, in between, go and do um, otaku. Right? That feels like a good idea. Let's go and do otaku in between. I, I think I think that'll be quite fun. Okay. Um, head to the snowfield for secret training. Well, my secret training, ladies and gentlemen, is going to be doing otaku. So let's head to Tokyo to the shopping area. Where we can hopefully find... Where are they? They're like, oh, they're bloody hell. They're like, over here. Yeah, they're in here. Okay. Otaku, ladies and gentlemen. Got the defense plus manual. There they are. Okay, let's do it. We're going to use probably the same formation. Maybe something slightly different. Uh, I kind of like the idea of using... We're going to swap Willy. In I mean, I love Willy, but we're going to swap Willy with, Na with, um, with Nathan. Give Nathan a go. And we'll swap Cheney with Lou Edmonds for no reason other than just variety is the spice of life. Okay, Otaku is up. Let's take him on. What's up, lads? We can see if there's any interesting players in Otaku. Okay, this is the squad. I won't bother going over it. Um, right, so they have Sam Idol with Lucky. Oh my god, that level's quite high. Interesting. Earthquake on cosplay. Interesting. Fake Ball Bewildered. Fake Ball Bewildered. Divine Arrows on custom with Lucky and Study. Intriguing. Maybe Gabby Farmers who we pick up. Maybe. Dual Strike with Bewildered and Defense Scan. Looks like a good all-around player. Okay, I'm liking some of these picks. I think Theodore Master is, I think, probably the one that's bump jumping out to me the most. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe Theodore Master. Give him another defensive move. Gabby Farmer also seems pretty good, though. I think I'm probably preferring Master. As much as I like the idea of using Divine Arrows with Lucky and Study. I think I might go for Theodore Master. Okay, we'll... Okay, okay. We'll, we'll think about it. We'll think about it. Right. So, but now, for now, I mean, anyway, our focus should just be on actually, like, getting a result. That would probably be the good thing to do. Okay, get that Ghost Pull. Over to you. Never mind. Okay. Right. Here's your moment, Toad. Here's your moment. Fake ball. Okay. We're going to do the exact same thing we did last time, which is called the double warp drive. Can Toad pull it off and prove that he is the ultimate dribbler? Never mind. I clicked the wrong thing. I clicked the wrong thing. I clicked the, I clicked the wrong thing. In a frenzy, I clicked the wrong thing. Okay. Bring it back over to Toad. Is my man the ultimate dribbler? Or was God lying to me? He is! He's the ultimate dribbler. Warp Drive beats out Fake Ball. Despite the pretty low level. And we're now going to go for an Angry Penguin number two. And hopefully get a goal. Come on. No money, no money, no money, no money. Never mind. Okay, that's fine. Where are they passing it to? They're passing it right to Blood, who is going to immediately shoot in a Shine Drive. I almost completely messed up there with a misclick. I'd have gotten these catch. They do stop it. Our goal here is not to, to defeat, is not to like score immediately. Our goal, we almost pulled it off, is simply to put Jonathan Seller in a position where he can run up. He can pull off the attack scan. 
And then he can score with the Inazuma one. Right. Right. What? Excuse me. Um... Um, okay, right. That was mildly embarrassing. Um, okay, right. Okay, let's try this one more time. Let's try this one more time. We have nothing to prove this time. Except, I mean, I guess that we're a good team. That'd be pretty handy to prove. Cyborg with defense scan. Bring it over to... Never mind, he's offside. Okay, almost bring it over to Jonathan Seller. We're actually going to try something different this time. We're going to shoot immediately with Eric with Tri Pegasus. I'm pretty sure if I'm going to bring his 2 AI, he should bring it up straight to Eric. Straight into the goalkeeper's face for Tri Pegasus. And there we go. Attempt number two going infinitely better already. Bloody hell. Okay, Jonathan Seller doesn't quite get past online. That's absolutely all right. I'm just going to kind of let things do their thing. All we need to do is just make sure at least one of our players... Beautiful. Okay, over to Blood. Over to Jonathan Seller. Over to Jude. Over to Jonathan freaking Seller. For the Inazuma one... Knock it to him, my guy. Never mind. Jonathan Seller! Jonathan bloody Seller! Okay. I think I found the new Messi. I think I found the new Ronaldo. I think I found the new bloody Cristiano Ronaldo. And his name's Jonathan freaking Seller. And his name's Jonathan freaking Seller! Okay, ignore that. That didn't happen. That that did not happen. Okay, right. Anyway, it's fine though because we have this. I was gonna say the best midfielder in the game, but then Toad kind of proved himself. Can we stop fouling, please? Like I'm noticing this is happening more and more, and I'm not quite a fan of it. Infantile just got beat out there, unfortunately. We should be all right though for a cheeky margin in the hand. Yeah, turns out that Mark is pretty good at this whole football malarkey. Even though we just threw. We just... Okay, we just absolutely threw that goal. Because I was trying to pass the ball to Toad. Sure. Okay. But it's fine though, because it's full time anyway. And we scored the win. We scored the fat dub. Hell yeah. Take that, Otaku. Take that, and Jack learn mole fake. Take that. Jonathan Th Seller is up to level 13 after proving himself to be an absolute god in that game. I think it's fair to say, y'all, that we scouted two pretty darn good players. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. And for now, bye.